Hey there, game changers. I've got a question for you. Can wind turbine blades be used to address urban heat island effect? Well, we're going to talk about that in what I'm calling blades for shade. You are undoubtedly aware of how absolutely enormous wind turbine blades are, 100 feet long or more. So it should come as no surprise to you to know that in order to create something as big as they are, as energy efficient as they are, and able to withstand the type of winds that they do, well, that is some serious engineering. So it is a shame to find out that most of these blades wind up in landfills because they are too uh, cost prohibitive to recycle. But it doesn't have to be that way. What if those blades are reused? And this is where the urban heat island effect comes in. Picture this, a sunny urban street where trees are not really a feasible option for providing shade, a situation that many urban planners are all too familiar with. Now what if instead we line both sides of the street with 15 to 20 foot sections of beautiful wind turbine blades and string between them a canopy of native deciduous vining vegetation? Or what if those wind turbine blades are manipulated into artful structures that also provide shade in urban parks. I'm trying to keep this video brief, so I'm gonna leave it right there. But if you'd like to talk about this more, you can vote for this video and we'll talk about it down the road. Thanks for your time, for watching, and for your vote. And uh, I will see you down the road.